Hey guys, so today I have a flat iron um, for your hair that I haven't opened up yet, as you can see. So I'm going to go ahead and open it and let's get a first hand look of it together and uh, just take a look. So this is how it arrived inside the actual packaging. It arrived from Amazon. So I took it out of the packaging of that already. Uh, I order way too much from Amazon to keep track. So this is how it actually looks inside the box or packaging that from Amazon. So that being said, slide the sleeve off. And so far I'm liking this zipper case. Nice quality. And I like on here it tells you in a, you have a embossed kind of letters, you know, raised up. Hair styling iron two two and one. So get this open. So you can see it has not been used or taken out the package at all. It's still the original packaging. So see everything's okay, so we have some Velcro straps which it keeps everything secure. So this is good for someone who travels. Take this plastic sleeve off. And I am pretty impressed because I've never actually seen a flat iron like this before. I've used quite a few flat irons, but this one's the most unique. Um, I'm not sure if you're catching it, but it has like this little curvature to it. It's not just flat. And as you can see, this has more of like a crooked look to it. So it it's not straight up and down, or at least, you know, it goes, it closes fully, but there's kind of a curve to it. So I'm not sure if the camera is really giving you a good visual as far as that goes, but it's really unique, not to say the least. And I, I like it. It's pretty, pretty nice. So I guess for me, my big thing is how long does this take to heat up? How to use it? So... Get this out. I have an electrical cord here, standard US outlet plug, so nothing fancy. So we'll go ahead and get these ties off. We have some twisty ties here, and uh, we'll get this plugged in, and we can kind of take a, a better look. And I can see how it heats up, um, and also look at this instruction booklet firsthand and see what's going on with how to use this thing um hoping it's not too difficult it's probably pretty simple but all right so i just got i just got my iron plugged in and i'm not sure if y'all noticed but you can see a, a little green light right in here that that indicates that it's been plugged in from what i'm seeing so we have a, a green light on right here. So there's no buttons from what I'm seeing. Oh, here we go. Here's a, on the opposite side of my light is a little power switch. So let me get a close up for y'all. So just as a reminder, I've taken this out the package. First time ever using or seeing one of these. So try to get it on an angle so you can see we have a power button. I'm going to go ahead and push this. Okay, so you see it lit up when I pushed it. And so, okay, so just so y'all know, because I don't think the camera's going to pick, is picking this up. It's showing the temperature, um, the number. Yeah, it's not really going to pick it up because of the curvature. The one thing I can tell you right now I don't like is that it's in Celsius, not Fahrenheit. And since I use Fahrenheit, you know, that definitely makes things a lot more difficult. And I always use the highest setting, so let me see. Okay, so every time you hit the power button, the light adjusts up, as y'all could probably see. So, I put on a high setting. Definitely hot already. Very hot. So, definitely has a good heat up time very quickly. So, I'm really liking this. I can, in fact, I wish y'all could, could smell this because I can actually smell, smell the heat on here. And so let me see about this instruction booklet. So, so, so far I'm impressed. We have a case, a very unique styling iron, very easy to turn on, very easy to operate. 
heats up very quickly. Do not like that it's the temperatures in Celsius rather than Fahrenheit. So it's called a twist styling iron. So we have the instructions right here. Okay, so there's apparently a concave. Okay, so yeah, we have a concave plate. I don't think I want to hold that while it's on, but oops. so it's telling you operations on inside here. The camera's not picking it up because of the light hitting it, but they have instructions on how to make the curls, how to make it straight. Um, insert the plug into the outlet, turn on after use, press the power two button two seconds to turn off. And so it tells you you have cleaning instructions, storage instructions. So that's pretty cool. So um, I have to say I'm, I'm quite impressed. I'm going to try and see what happens. I need to wash my hair so you'll have to forgive me. But just to show... Here's my hair here. It's already kind of straight from straightening it previously before I had gotten this in. But just out of curiosity to see what happens so I can give y'all. So gliding, it, it doesn't seem to glide very smoothly like my typical straightener does. Let me try and do this on camera for you. So I'm sorry if they're not getting a good visual. Um, so... I'm not too sure how I feel about it. it. It definitely heats up quickly, but it just doesn't, and it's definitely straightening. It's definitely straightened it, but I'm not too sure. I like the whole two-in-one style thing, so let me see if I could try and do this if I want to do a curl. I mean, again, I'm just kind of experimenting here. There we go. So I like it definitely for curls. I mean, it's going to take practice. I'm hunched over trying to get in this camera to show you. But, um, so straining wise, uh, not my thing. Um, but to get that curl, that, that just won me over, to be honest. Um, I was feeling kind of iffy on it. But I've actually been trying to find a good curling iron, and I suck terribly with curling irons. So um, the fact that I was able to just get a curl kind of you know not putting much effort into it is very impressive to me so definitely pleased and that just won me over so if you're looking to do curls this thing is awesome so overview love it great case heats up quickly get um easy to use easy to operate you got the us plug i do not like the Celsius, I want Fahrenheit temperature. Um, it doesn't have a smooth feeling pull when you're trying to straighten it, my hair, but as far as trying to curl it, that was a breeze and I really wasn't expecting anything. So I'm, I'm pretty impressed. And yeah, so uh, just be careful because this is hot. Um, I still have mine turned on and plugged in. I'm going to play with this some more. But, so overall, um, I think I definitely can recommend it now. That, Like I said, that curl won me over because I was not expecting that. So, impressive. I'll have a link in the description for anybody interested in checking out more information or possibly buying one for themselves.